Okay, that's all the spine parts cast now and then just really roughly assembled so you can get an idea of what it looks like. Um, they've been pretty roughly clean. There's still a hell of a lot of clean up to actually do in this uh, surface. Uh, but looking at them, there's no major flaws there. It's all going to uh, clean up quite nicely. We've still got a bit of carving out of pieces to do in certain places. But that gives you an idea of what to look like. Quite happy with that overall. Uh, the biggest thing, obviously, to, that we've been trying to get is that flexibility. Forwards and backwards. Um, to give you an idea of the alignment, this is the, the piece that's been done solid from those two holes to those two holes there. Um, it's got a seam line down there, but that'll be hidden uh, inside the actual um, torso section. Uh, I'll give you a quick idea of what we're expecting to see. Those bits there allow for the back plate, which will go in there. And that's, that's sitting there at the moment. It should actually be a little bit more like that. Um, the idea with that is that we've got positions here and here which will actually I'll use as is real mounting points uh, to actually attach uh, the spine and the back plate in place so that we're starting to get a solid part to work off. Even with that set there you can still see that it maintains that, that flexibility that we're after um, and that's generally the idea so that we can uh, pose him in all sorts of different positions so that's the idea. Um, the parts do actually rotate as well um, and because of the, the nature of the aluminium or well, the alloy that's cast in there the in inside is going to be left deliberately a little bit rough so that when the actual tension is put on the spine um, they can sort of bite into position and be, be, be locked into place. Um, even now it sort of holds its shape quite well and that's without any real tension on there at all so I'm quite pleased with that so far. Um, the next thing to do is basically get that uh, ball joint piece made up uh, which I've actually got cast uh, which is still rough cast that'll actually be inserted into the into the top um, to actually accommodate for the head piece to be mounted onto and, and then on to the next stuff. So that's basically the head section and the hip section. Uh, from there I'll look at working out how to mount the back plate to it uh, to get a successful sort of mount from there. Uh, and then that will give me a structure that I've, I've then got a frame around here that I can actually uh, mount the entire thing to um, and basically start building pieces off on a case-by-case, piece-by-piece basis. So that's the general idea.